Do you want to set good high sets? Uh, do you want to set like the world's best players? What do you need uh, to do that? What should you work on? That's what we will look uh, at uh, in this video. Thanks to Lei for a question that uh, inspired me to make this video. And I think it's a topic that's important for more than just uh, setters. Sure, a setter's job is to set the ball to be the brain of the team. But all other players should also be complex and uh, able to make a quality high sets uh, from the field. A volleyball weights uh, 260 to 280 grams. Uh, if you want to set high sets to 6 to 9 meters distance with the parabola touching 6 meters, you need to give the ball some uh, serious kinetic energy. And that's not uh, so easy if you have uh, weak fingers or perhaps uh, improper technique. But the main thing uh, that affects uh, these high sets is your power. The power you can transfer to the ball. When we are setting, we are primarily engaging the muscles in our fingers, wrists, uh, forearm, triceps and uh, shoulder muscles. We also need to use our legs uh, to help us uh, set the ball. And that's uh, why I'm going to show you some great exercises to develop uh, strength and momentum in these areas. We'll start by stretching our fingers, wrists and forearms. Uh, reach out in front of you and uh, with the other hand grasp uh, fingers pointing down. We try to stretch the fingers and uh, forearms as much as possible, but we don't go over the pain. After a while we switch uh, hands and continue to stretch uh, these uh, important muscles uh, for setting. Then we sit down on the floor, slowly laying our hands on the floor on the outside. Lightly, really with a little power, we push into the ground, stretching the muscles on the outside of the wrist and forearm. Once we are stretched, uh, we start with the fingers exercises, because you need uh, strong fingers to set. Stand half a meter from the wall and lean against the wall with your fingers spread, palms not touching the wall. The position of your hands and elbows uh, should be like uh, when doing uh, push-ups. Once you are touching the wall, uh, slowly approach uh, the wall and stay in this uh, static position for about uh, 20 seconds. You will feel the pressure in the fingers you are leaning on and at the same time uh, your pectoral muscles are working. A more challenging variation of this exercise is on the ground, where you again lean on your fingers, uh, straighten your body and stay in this uh, plank position. Here you only need to hold this position for 10 seconds uh, since it's uh, quite challenging for your fingers. And the most difficult exercise is to perform push-ups uh, on your fingers. I recommend doing this only when you know your fingers are strong enough. Another exercise to strengthen your fingers is to hang from a bar or similar device. Uh, we catch ourselves at the height so that our feet uh, don't touch the ground. And we hold the entire weight of our body by gripping our hands tightly. You can stay in this position for up to 30 seconds. An elastic band is an excellent for strengthening the wrist. We press the band in the middle of its length uh, with our foot on the ground. Then we grasp a band in our palms and uh, clench it into a fist. We raise our elbows to 90 degrees uh, to the body and start to make movements uh, with our wrists. Where we loosen our wrists, uh, the band pulls us down and then we tighten it. You should only be working with your wrist and forearm muscles, uh, no elbow movement. Once you have uh, 10 reps, uh, then turn your hands over, forearm facing ground and start working by lifting your wrists up and performing uh, 10 reps. Now we are going to do some triceps exercises. For the first exercise we will use an elastic band and throw it over the net uh, by the pole. Stand a little bit away from the pole, grasp uh, the elastic tightly and start pulling the elastic band down. Our elbows are fixed along uh, the body, they don't move. Uh, we are just working the tricep and doing uh, 10 reps. The second exercise that primarily engages uh, the triceps is close push-ups, where we put our arms alongside our body and uh, do push-ups. I'm not going to tell you to do some amount of uh, push-ups here. Uh, it depends on you and your strength. And now we are on the biggest muscles we engage when setting. We are going for the shoulders. Professional setters uh, pay a lot of attention uh, to the shoulders uh, power development and uh, they do shoulder presses in the gym uh, when they lift uh, weights above their head. In this exercise we lower down our elbows to shoulder level and slowly lift the dumbbells overhead. The second and harder variation of uh, shoulder presses is the Arnold press, where you not only lift the dumbbells uh, above your head, uh, but also perform a movement uh, with them in front of your body. But the shoulders and not only them uh, can be trained in the hall with a medicine ball, which we throw away to simulate uh, the actual setting. I do these exercises myself with a 3 kg medicine ball, but if you are just starting out with medicine ball exercises, take a lighter medicine ball. At first we will only engage the shoulders while kneeling on our feet approximately 4 meters from the pole. Kneel and throw the medicine ball as high and far as possible. 
we can't use our legs to help us uh, and we are mainly using our shoulders, uh, triceps and wrists. Then uh, stand in the middle of the court, approximately 3 meters uh, from the net. We grab the medicine ball and from a position above the forehead we throw it towards uh, like when setting high sets uh, for outside hitter. We will use all the power we have to throw it. Also we need to use our legs uh, to help us. It's a mistake to throw the medicine ball below face level. Always keep it above the forehead uh, when throwing it. Because in volleyball we also uh, set ball above the forehead. We are going to do 10 throws. Now we are going to do the same exercise only backwards. Trying out the medicine ball throws in the back. Again we stand in the middle of the court 3 meters from the net and uh, we throw the medicine ball behind our head. This exercise is more challenging than uh, forward setting uh, but if you really want to set high and well you can't do it uh, without backward sets. Now we are also going to do 10 throws. And the most difficult exercise with the medicine ball is throw after absorbing the energy of the falling medicine ball into our hands. We throw the medicine ball about a meter above us and immediately after touching it uh, we try to throw medicine ball out of our hands uh, as quickly as possible. This exercise uh, prepares us uh, for a situation uh, when we have to make a high set once the ball comes uh, from a high attitude after a reception or defense. And I mustn't forget the actual setting of the ball. We stand 2 or 3 meters away from the wall and start setting the ball as high as possible into the wall. This is also a challenging exercise uh, that will help you to strengthen your fingers and uh, generate more power for the set. If you want uh, not only set high sets but also improve your setting technique, uh, then watch my video on ideal setting technique. Either way, I believe uh, my tips and exercises uh, for building more power and strength for setting high sets will help you become a better player. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.